And incidentally, it's six years Agassi since Todd Martin beat Agassi on a hard court on this surface. This shot, which was slightly better than he meant, played too far from the body, stopped a run of five points to Agassiz. Two-handed backhand has weight. He's got good control of that. 15, and I think particularly on the service return, that's going to be a very important shot. <laughs> Certainly not as quick as Agassi. You can see it from the way he tried to get to that. That's just what a scene. Biggest tennis stadium in the world, something too big. That was a great serve. Had a load of slice on it, and it hit the line. Early and it's difficult to chance your arm on returns of serve right at the start of a, a match at the Grand Slam final. But I would say that Martin has to get his returns going. He has to be more aggressive, have to has to take more risks. He's not going to beat Agassi from the back of the court. He's not as long as Agassi feeds him lots of backhands. Agassi's got to pepper that forehand where mistakes can and will come. <laughs> Just about a perfect shot here, the off forehand. Plop on the right on the tee virtually. <laughs> Martin to reach the final was served 105 aces. That compares with Agassiz 61. A bit impetuous, this. Hey! I can understand why Martin on that previous point wanted to get the ball put away as quickly as possible. He doesn't want to give. Agassi a second shot, but that's a better game there by Martin. 
who leads 2 1. Agassi started really hot, didn't he? I mean, he came out as always, he leads the way out. He wants to get out there first, he wants to choose the chair where he wants to be. He always waves to the crowd and they wave back to him. You can see why he's so popular, because he really does relate to the crowd and they love him, particularly this US crowd, love him for it. It's not only the US crowd, is it, Jerry? I mean, all around the world, he is a character. Todd Martin was asked uh, when he won his se semi-final which of all the Grand Slam championships he would most like to win. And he said, oh, the US Open. Uh, he said, you know, in front of my own crowd, he said, that's not den to denigrate, he studied linguistics, it says words like that, that's not to denigrate the other Grand Slams, but this one. Well, he's a very good guy. Good is the right word for Todd Martin. I think, really, he, uh, in Davis Cup, for example, where the pressure is hottest, he loses with dignity and he wins with uh, modesty and humility. He's, uh, he's not flamboyant in the very least, Todd Martin, golfing partner of uh, Pete Sampras. Agassi, he really could only come from Las Vegas, couldn't he? Son of this uh, Iranian boxer, Olympic boxer. And he's got something of the boxer in him, a sort of light middleweight, on the alert, always, always moving. A one-off tennis player. In your face, Bill. Absolutely. Very honest there, very articulate. I guess he's got the break. The worst possible start for Martin. He's actually broken right at the start. It's 2-1. a chance for Martin to get back. He needs to do that. He needs to do it early on. very little that Agassi could do here except drive it more or less at the man and to his credit slight miss hit but Martin dug it back Chances in this game with Martin, and he really hasn't been confident enough, I think, uh, or willing enough to risk. Certainly didn't play them well. And now he's paying a penalty for that. How 40 it was. That's the serve against this man that's going to win points. 
wide to the forehand. Vital game this one for so early in the match. It completely single-minded, knew exactly what he was going to attack. The target was wide, reaching for Martin to the back end. And in the end, on the third attempt, Agassi got it. It's the second game point to go 3-1 up. Two particularly frustrating games, I think, for Todd Martin. The first game that he served and there, he had three chances to break there, didn't take them. He's got to be more positive. Yep, concur, Jerry. And of the two players, immediately Agassi looks much the cooler. And I mean cooler because of the heat of today. It's still hot, it's a beautiful day. Todd Martin shows the heat and doesn't enjoy it. In fact, he virtually collapsed in his match with Rafa in the Davis Cup up in Boston where it was boiling. He did collapse at the uh, Australia semi-final in Washington a couple of years ago. He collapsed at the opening ceremony. Well, he's played two good points. He's moving a bit better here. Yeah, this is a really beautiful half volley here down the line. Perfect. And actually see a mark sometimes on these courts and players like to go and peer at it. Careful, he mustn't lapse back into this rather overcautious mood at the back of the court. He was 40 love up in the third game when Agassi ended up breaking him. <laughs> 